uh, hi everyone welcome to this session so this is a very important circuit for analog design interview so we have to find the waveform like we have to draw the waveform of this v naught voltage this v minus voltage this voltage across the capacitor and the currents through the capacitor okay and we have given that there the input of this uh, open base circuit is uh, unit step uh, unit step function okay so so this is the circuit so you can ask the interviewer like is the is the op amp is ideal is the op amp ideal ideal so let the op amp is ideal this means the gain gain of this op amp is infinite okay and you you have to see uh, what are the supply rails uh, for this particular op amp let's say the op amp supplies are uh, plus 5 volt and minus 5 volts okay so we need need this uh, specifications as well okay so and we have to we have require uh, power power rail specification okay now for open base circuit you have to see first is there is a negative feedback or not or the open base ideal or not so one condition is open base ideal so this is okay and this is a negative feedback, negative feedback right as this is negative so this is negative feedback and our open base ideal so we can directly use we can directly use uh, virtual short concept right and for virtual short concept we know that this terminal the voltage of this terminal and voltage of this terminal is equal so what we know is v minus equal v plus for this virtual short concept and if 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 this is like if this is a ground like like at this moment this is ground okay so and there is a constant voltage source of v in so there will be a constant current flowing through this path right let i so ir let let this is ir so a constant current is flowing through this path right because this is a constant voltage and this is a constant resistance and this voltage is grounded so the ir value is nothing but v in minus 0 divided by r so this is nothing but 1 by r okay 1 by r amps so this is the this is the constant current flowing through this path and we know that no current can uh, go to this op amp terminal okay so there no current can pass through this so all of the current has to flow through this path okay so now if this current has to flow through this path so the ir current is flowing through this capacitor as well so a constant current is charging the capacitor okay so if constant current is charging a capacitor the voltage across the capacitor will be a ramp right we know that so this is a constant current let's say i and this is c and this is t so a constant current is flowing through the capacitor and charging it so the voltage across the capacitor this is this voltage minus this voltage will all will have to be a ram voltage right so let come down so so we can see that let at and 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 the constant current is like if 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 a constant like if a ram voltage is developing across the capacitor and this voltage is zero okay this voltage is zero so v out has to be a ramp as well but in negative slope right as vc is charging okay and vc is nothing but vc is nothing but v minus minus v out and this voltage is grounded okay so this is grounded so if if and this is positive okay vc is positive positive according to our according to our notation this voltage is positive and this voltage is negative so as v, vc is positive so our v not must have a negative like v not must be negative so that we can get the positive of vc so this will be this so at like and this is this is also a ramp so if our vc is like this then our v naught will be like this 
so it will get saturated after some time right because there is limited power rail of this op amp this is plus minus 5 volts so let let t equals t not at some point let t equals t not at some point so this is our t not okay let's this is our t not okay so this is t not t t not t this is t this is t this is t not okay so let let this is our v not this is our vc this is our v negative v minus and this is our ic okay so what we what we have seen that the output voltage is going to negative so let the output is like this so this is our output let's say this is our output okay and after that if when the output is like reach to minus 5 volt it will get saturated right we know that the output cannot be more or less than plus minus 5 volt so let this is this and this is our output is saturated so this is our minus 5 volts okay now now if the if the like if if our op amp is saturated in saturation op amp op amp now in saturation so we cannot apply the uh, like apply the uh, virtual short concept okay virtual short concept is not valid when the satu when the op amp is in saturator so after like t equals t not the op amp is not like we cannot apply the virtual short concept so the circuit will become like this okay and op amp is saturated to like v out is minus 5 volt okay and this is minus this is plus and this is short circuit and this is our on volt step input okay and this is our this is c so what will happen actually in this condition the op amp is actually not working okay so our circuit will will like will modify to this okay so this is our vc this is our v minus this is our v not this is r and this is our this is our on voltage of input okay on voltage of input so this will the this will our reduce circuit now we can see that this is a this is like this is a like this is minus 5 voltage right so we can see that this is nothing but a normal rc indicator circuit and a current in flowing through this path okay okay current is flowing through this path so the capacitor will try to charge its voltage okay so we know that and there will be a exponential charging right exponential charging as there is there is not a like not a infinite current present in this circuit okay if there is infinite current we know that the capacitor can charge change its uh, uh, potential across it uh, in like in a in instantly okay but the, here it is not possible okay instantly the capacitor will not change its value so if the capacitor is charging its value what will be the voltage like this voltage is like what is the vc vc is nothing but v minus minus v naught and this voltage is fixed okay this voltage is fixed so the v minus 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 5 volt so this will be v minus plus 5 volt right so this will be the voltage like at the steady state and we know that like if 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 capacitor is charging in this way so this potential has to rise okay because this is a fixed voltage okay so that the vc will increase and charged up to like charge up to a value so this as this voltage is fixed so this voltage has to be increased so that the capacitor can get charged okay and the charging will be exponential okay so what is the what will be the waveform so we know that vc will be like opposite of v naught at t t equals t naught right so this is 5 volt right 
as this is minus 5 volt okay so up to this and uh, and we know that v minus like this point this point this point was at 0 volt volt due to the virtual short concept at t equals t naught so this will be t equals t naught there, there will be a zero voltage and after t naught this this voltage will increase in exponential form right as vc has to be charged so there will be a wave like this and this what will be the like maximum value this will be maximum of on voltage right because the input is on voltage and and the capacitor is also try to charging so we know that uh, vc is nothing but uh, v minus minus like plus 5 volt as we have write this equation okay so the the output waveform of vc will be like this okay this will be exponential as well so let me draw in a good manner so this will be our 5 volt okay and there will be an exponential charging up to this is this is the difference is on voltage okay this is on volt so if this is 5 volt this will be the 6 volt okay so this will be the waveform of the vc like voltage across the capacitor and this will be the potential at the yeah, non like inverting terminal of this socket and what will be the ic we can see that at t equals t naught there will be a constant current flowing through this path ir okay and this is nothing but ic so there will be a constant current flowing through this capacitor so this is nothing but uh, 1 by r okay like 1 volt by r and after that the capacitor like as the capacitor is charging and going to steady state so the current is exponentially decaying to zero voltage so the waveform will be like this okay so this will be our current waveform so actually these four waveform you need to draw at the interview session okay so this is a very good question and it will build your intuition as well actually this there is two concepts uh, one is for op amp and another another is uh, lie on the rc circuit okay so this is a very good problem so okay you can you can you can try yourself as well uh, uh, before doing like before seeing my solution i think this will be helpful for you as well so you can give your valuable suggestions uh, for my further videos okay so yes thank you okay